Hello my friends, welcome again. In this video I'm going to add the site map in the dashboard. So here is our application and I have registered as a test user, test a test and add the password here. Okay. Here is our dashboard and I want to change this a little bit and I have find this uh, in Alpine toolbox because we have uh, Alpine in our application if you go to application here and search for JS inside the resources and I'm going to remove this and you see we have uh, Alpine.js here okay and in, in the Alpine toolbox uh, go for the in the nav direction and we have this uh, navbar drop down click here and we have, we have a navbar and sidebar so I'm going to Choose this one and uh, copy this. Okay. Well, I'm going to copy with the old body. Come here and I'm going to search for up uh, layouts inside the layouts, up blade, yeah. Here. And I'm going to add it to remove and change with this, this one. Okay. And if I go now to the dashboard to see what we have. Yeah, here it is. We have a Nice side nav here and it's uh, white so if I want to add the dark as well and come in here in the HTML add the class uh, dark okay and now we can see we have a dark mode here but we need to add on with the dark, so if I select all the dark mode, okay, and change to only dark, come here, refresh, and now we have the dark mode. If you don't like dark mode, you can change this to white, okay, and come here, refresh, sorry. Uh, refresh and now we have white but I like dark or we can make this with a toggle and change this to, but I'm going to leave it as it is now I want the dark mode okay now here uh, if you go down there And we have a nav bar here. Okay, here we have a button. When we click, okay, and if I add the edge one here. Uh, welcome for example just to see where we are and the refresh and uh, here we are here but this text is a uh, dark mode and if I change this if we have a dark I'm going to change the text to be gray uh, 100 and come here refresh and yeah, now we have the welcome here. Okay. 
uh, I want to add what we had here so remove for now just a second and add the heading and the mine copy here and remove this uh, body and now add it here okay so if I refresh and we have this kind of thing because uh, sorry, I want to add first a div with class of uh, window full and maybe margin 2 or just window full I'm going to leave and add it here, this one so if I refresh okay, yeah but we have a bg white and if we have a dark mode here i'm going to change to bg gray 800 and max width i'm going to remove this just margin left to four come here refresh and yes of course we have this but uh, I'm going to change the list to 900 Refresh And now we have a dark board here Maybe To 700 I want to make a change So look something different yeah, Now it's more better And uh, if I go to the dashboard, so search for the dashboard blade, we have a header here and we have a text with a text gray 800. I'm going to change this if we have a BG, if we have a dark mode. So if we have a dark mode, I'm going to change the text color to gray 200 and the refresh. Okay, now it's more nice for me and I'm going to change this one as well so in our wrap plate we just add the slot here and this slot is uh, this one so we have a slot name header header for this and the mine slot is down there and we have the max width of 7xl, remove this and add margin left the same thing the 4 ok and we have vg white here and down there select both and add uh, when we have dark mode add the bg gray uh, 800 just to see what we have yeah something like that uh, I think it's okay okay but I don't want the border here I'm going to remove the border I refresh yeah here it is and and then on the this at px.2 uh, refresh yeah I think it now is more beautiful you can do what you want but for me it's okay and uh, what we can do we can see want to check, see if we have an yeah it's responsive and we have a drop down here okay and i think we are good for this video if you like please subscribe and like to my like this video and share with your friends it's going to help me to do more videos like this and see you in the next one thank you very much and 
All the best.